Does money really matter when it comes to first dates? Yesterday, Andrew and I were debating this very question. Girls do not care how much money a guy spends on a date. Okay? I disagree. You have to treat them nice. No, like if a girl likes you, she likes you for you. Like I... She does not care about money. So I took it to the extreme. Andrew's gonna take my sister Lexi on a date with a budget of only $10. While me and Pearson fly across the world to go on the most expensive date, planning to spend over $100,000. Oh my god. <laughs> what? I'll start packing my bag. <laughs> So we packed our bags and took the next non-stop flight to one of the most expensive places in the world, Singapore. I am so <laughs> glad that we got the $100,000 date. I feel bad for Andrew and Lexi. Andrew's probably having the time of his life, but Lexi just wants to be anywhere but there. Lexi probably hates her life. Yeah. What's up guys? So uh, I'm here to pick up Lexi actually. Picking her up in this, because I couldn't afford gas. Lexi loves me. She loves me for me, not my money. Oh wait. I almost forgot these flowers. That's good. That's perfect. All right, so we finally got to the hotel after a 19-hour flight. I don't think I've ever traveled that much before. Me neither. So we have a whole private villa to ourselves. You ready to check it out? I'm so ready. Yeah. And welcome to the Aquarius Vida. Allow oh me to show you to your room. Oh. Welcome. Oh my God! And it smells so good in here. <laughs> Yes, it's a private pool with a very nice view. So, we, I, I don't belong here. <laughs> oh my god. It says, welcome. Little bears in Rome. Oh my. So unnecessary, but I love it so much. It, it opens up to the pool. You know, Brent, there's no lifeguard on duty, so you're gonna have to watch out when you swim. <laughs> I know you can't swim. <laughs> oh my god. We have our own what? massage room? What? This is your personal massage room. I know what I'm doing later on. <laughs> Couples massage? Couples massage. <laughs> you, when, while you're taking a bath, you can watch TV. Very, very YouTube video. Videos on it. We'll take it back. <laughs> oh, what's right. that? Oh, this is actually some welcome drink for you. It's actually oh. fresh coconut water. Oh. Yes. Cheers. Cheers to our hundred thousand dollar vacation. Starts now. Mm. Friends, help, help. Whoa, 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 whoa. There's a big bug on our bed. Huh? A big bug? A big bug on our bed, and you have to kill it. Please, please. Oh. Ah! No! Why did you scream? Oh my no. God. Uh, Jack, no! You left the doors open. I saw the bug fly you in. You close the doors too. <gasps> got it. No way. No I way. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so it's getting late, guys, and uh, tomorrow I have a big day planned for you. Oh my god, I'm going to sleep, so tomorrow can start earlier. Bye. All right, okay. Good night, Pearson. While Pearson and I started the day off strong, Andrew was pretty optimistic as well. Hey, Lexi. What are you doing? What do you mean? Are you you ready to go on a date? You look stupid. Lexi, you know, I only have $10. Like, this is like as much as I could do. We're not, I'm not going on that. Yeah, you are. Do you like me for like me or my money? I don't like you at all. Oh, I got you a cute helmet. You just gonna carry the flowers in your hand or are you gonna oh, do wait. it? Thank you. Well, oh, they actually do smell really good. Right? All right, so Pearson, are you ready for the big day? I don't know what to expect, but I'm ready. All right. Pearson, I think our ride's here. This is not ours. Oh, yes, it is. It's a Rolls Royce. Yeah. I've never driven in a car like this before. Really? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, thank you. This is incredible. <laughs> and this was just the beginning. Our first stop, the zoo. I got a private tour for us. Oh my god, I haven't been to a zoo in so long. Me, me neither. <laughs> let's go. Okay, let's go. Before? Oh my god. These rhinos are kind of cute. That one you can see it's butt. Oh, like that. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Hi, piggy. Okay, don't ever do that. Don't ever do that again. We should get one. It'll be our pet. We already have one, and it's me. I know. <laughs> we'll get another one. We'll so we're feeding one. goats right now. Oh my god, go. Wow. Oh, wow. She's the goat whisperer. I'm the goat whisperer. She got it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. you're welcome. Yeah. This turtle right here is 90 years old. Oh my god. If it stepped on my foot, I would probably break my foot. Oh yeah. What? Oh my god. Oh wow. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay. All right, ready? Andrew's butt is on my handlebars. Yeah, that's what it's for. What do you mean? So you could grip my cheeks and use them as handlebars. All right, ready? I'm scared. Wait, what do I do with my legs? Hold on, don't go it. Why are we going so fast? Wait, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now it's time to take you to dinner. Ready? Where are we going for dinner? Oh, I'm gonna take you somewhere where they literally cook right in front of you. Ooh, okay. <laughs> All right, so now we are going to a cooking class. We're gonna be learning how to make dim sum. Kirsten's not a very good uh, cook. I'm yeah. I'm really bad. You're gonna have to help me out with this. So one. that that's why we're here today. That's why we're here. <laughs> Okay. Okay. I wrote your name, Pearson. Oh, I see that, but we're on her time, and she's not here for that long. So let's get to cooking. Hey, she's gonna go and squish it and pinch. This is so hard. Uh, just like that. Is this good enough? Oh, that's nice. It's okay. She's like, no, it's okay, but let me fix it. <laughs> As of now, who do you think's doing a better job, me or Pearson? One of you. <laughs> no, that's not an answer. She likes me. She's more. trying to save your uh, feelings. Hey, Brent. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to kill you. Ta -da!
Oh, oh my wow. god. Wow, we did a good job. Wait a second, I'm really impressed with ourselves. <laughs> it's so hot, but so good. <laughs> mm. <sighs> Subway, really? Better than it looks, I swear to God. Go on. Oh my god. Right, whatever you want, like I got you. Right. Oh wait, okay. I already know what you want. Italian herbs and cheese bread, lettuce, extra banana peppers. See, they're cooking it like in front of you. Okay, but I don't like banana peppers. Yeah, you, you told me. I never said such a thing. Oh, that was that other girl. Okay, so we're in the harbor right now. We're about to go on a private yacht tour of the city. Dude, what? <laughs> All right, let's go, come on. Wow. This is literally crazy. We're here in Singapore on this massive yacht while Lexi and Andrew are probably, who knows what they're I feel, doing. I honestly, I feel so bad. We're living a dream. And they're like living a nightmare. That's so bad. Pearson, I'm driving the boat. No, you're not, Brent. Yes, I have. I don't feel like dying today, Brent, okay? Come we're on. gonna leave that to the driver. No. Okay. Is now a bad time to tell you that I get seasick? Oh. While Pearson was having the time of her life, Lexi could not say the same thing. So the date's going on like pretty well. What do you say? You're eating my sandwich. Would you want a bite? No, I'm not having fun. Okay, Lexi, so the date isn't over yet. I've still got one more thing, and I feel like this is gonna make up for it. Better make up for this. Let's go. Let me finish the sandwich. I said let's go. All right, so Pearson, do you see that massive Ferris wheel? Yeah, it's kind of hard to miss. Okay, so <laughs> it's the biggest Ferris wheel in the entire world. Tonight, I rented out a capsule to have dinner, oh. just me and you. No way! Oh, it costs $10,000, but anything for you. Wait, aren't, aren't you afraid of heights? Yes, but uh, let's not talk about that. Yeah. Come on, let's okay. go. Okay, all right. <laughs> Holy crap! Oh my god, this is so cute! This is where we're gonna be having dinner tonight, Pearson. Uh, <laughs> I don't think there's a cooler spot to have no, dinner. No, there's not. <laughs> this is like the place that you would propose. You're not gonna. <laughs> no, what would I do? We're literally going up right now. I am so scared. Everyone's staring at us watching us eat dinner. Look. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit of a surprise for you. I got you some flowers. Oh, this is so cute! Wait, Brent. <laughs> what? This is too much. This has been like the best day of my life. So we're getting to the top. Oh my god. Yo, we are so oh high up. Is, Brent, are you okay? No. Get me out of here. People, people ride this Ferris wheel all the time. We are 700 feet up in the air, Pearson. <laughs> Cheers mm -hmm. to a wonderful $100,000 date so far. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Just imagine, at any point, we could fall Don't to even us. say it. Don't fall, even say it. We could it. fall to the why ground you, and die. Why would you even I don't know where anything can happen. I wonder what Lexi and Andrew are doing right now. Probably the same thing. You think? No. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, you ready, Lexi? I'm ready. All right, this is literally one of the best things I've ever done. I used to last in my budget for this. Three, two, one. <laughs> what do you think? Wait, that's it? Thank you, guys. Thank Appreciate you. It. Thank that's you. it? Yeah. Why? That what was like two seconds. Yeah, Lexi, I only had five bucks left. What are you talking about? I wasted my whole day doing this. All right, I'm done. I'm going with the mariachi band. Lex, are you serious? So Andrew's date was cut a little short, but me and Pearson still had a long night ahead of us. Okay. Guys, this is our lovely waitress tonight. This is our waitress, Crystal. She works two jobs all while going to school in Singapore, and she was extremely kind to us. So we wanted to give her a little something. So I want to give you a thousand dollars. Huh? Yep. Are you sure? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Thank <laughs> you. Okay. So right now we are running to the gardens to see the light show. And the kindness didn't stop there. This is our driver, Elton. He helped us get around all day today and has been literally one of the nicest people I have ever met. We appreciate you and all that thank you've you. done today. Thank so we want to give you $1,500. Wow. Oh my God, thank you so much. Okay. You're welcome. Appreciate and it. for my sister, Lexi, who had a horrible time on her date, I ended up flying her out to Singapore Lexi. to meet up with us. That date was the worst. <laughs> <sighs> that was the longest day of my entire life. But the best day. The best day. No, seriously, it was so much better. Oh! 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 O
to determine which girl you end up with. Smell, touch, hear, taste. How is that even possible? <laughs> All right, so Jeremy, go ahead and put this blindfold on. The five girls are right behind you. Oh, crap. <laughs> All right, so the first sense is smell. This is going to be hard because I can't see anything, bro. All right, you ready for the first girl? All right, let's do it. Okay, let's go ahead and smell. <laughs> 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 It, it was Ben's armpit. No, it's not, bro. That's f***ing <laughs> gross. Hey, he's eliminated. He's out. Number one. What do you think? It kind of smells like Bath and Body Works. Like when you walk in like bath. No, no, that, no, that's a good scent though. Number two. <laughs> hmm. The first two smell good. Like sweet flowers in a way. Now we're going to do number three. All right. Jeremy likes this one. All right. You recognize the smell? I think from like my mom or something. Okay. <laughs> All right, so number four, you're up. I would say it kind of smelled expensive. Ooh. Let's do number five. <laughs> laundry in a way. Like yeah. dirty or clean laundry? Clean laundry. <laughs> now you have to eliminate one of them. Really? Who's it gonna be? Oh man. Dude, that is so hard, bro. Let's say girl number two. What's up, loser? <laughs> oh, what? What? I'm so sorry. What's wrong with my son? No, nothing. I just like, there was so many options. How does he smell? Zero out of ten. What? Oh. <laughs> the next sense is touch. Oh, what? So the girls will guide your hands to something that they want you to touch, okay? Oh, fuck. <laughs> okay, okay. She has really soft hair. This is so hard to describe. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, she Amazing. definitely works out. All right, number four, step up. I don't want Jeremy to touch me. He's gross. <laughs> oh, that's your hand? Okay, she has a lot of rings. Oh. oh yeah, she has really soft hair. <laughs> oh. Whoa. Oh! Whoa. 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 Wait, what was that? What'd you think of that? <laughs> well, yeah. Uh, <laughs> you like that? Alright, so Jeremy, now you have to eliminate one more girl. So who didn't you like to feel? I'm gonna go with number four. Oh! Four. oh. I think you're gonna really regret this. Oh! Wow! <laughs> I didn't even want to be here. This wasn't my idea. <laughs> <laughs> the next sense is hearing. Do you believe in love at first sight? I do believe in love at first sight. Because wow. you can see me. <laughs> <laughs> that was a pretty good one. And I like her accent. Ooh, huh? If I were a cat, I would spend all nine lives with you. Bro! That voice sounds really familiar, bro. Are you a transformer? Because you're Optimus Fine. <laughs> oh! Hey, my question is, did you look that up on Google before this? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Which one are you gonna eliminate now? But I'm gonna eliminate number one. Oh. Okay, Spig. Oh, nice wow. To see you again. What the heck? <laughs> All right, so Jeremy, there's only two girls left. The final sense is taste. What the heck does that mean? It means uh, a kiss. Really? Yeah. Oh my god. Three, two, one. Ooh, okay. All right. All right. <laughs> that was a good kiss. Three, two, one. All right. Look at Ben! What the hell just happened? So Jeremy, you have to eliminate now the final girl. Which number are you going to eliminate based off of those kisses? I'm going to have to eliminate number five. Oh, I'm so sorry. Jeremy! Uh, so Jeremy, that leaves one girl. Oh, wow! Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Oh. He was like blindfolded this whole time and he still chose you. Oh, that's yeah! Right. We're gonna go on a date now. You know, I'm already dressed up. We're ready. Oh, oh. Where, where are you taking her? McDonald's. What? Uh, we're, we're out of here, Brad. All right. All right, so Pearson, for your blind date, we have three mystery guys right here. <laughs> Each guy is standing over a trap door. You will ask a series of questions. Based off those questions, you'll eliminate them one by one. Okay, so Pearson, do you have your first question? Okay. What is your favorite feature of a girl? Honestly, I'd probably say lips. Oh. oh so I thought he was gonna be like, like ah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what about you, number two? I think nothing is better than a beautiful smile. Oh. oh that's cute. After smile, I'd go eyes. He likes your eyes, Pearson. And you're telling me that nobody here likes a big butt? Be honest. <laughs> uh, oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, number three. I don't, I can't offer that. So you want to eliminate number three? Yeah. <laughs> All right, number three, you can reveal yourself. Oh, no. He's wow. Oh, Sorry, oh, number three. Does he get a countdown or can I just. Oh! oh. <laughs> I'll give you a high five. There you go. Oh. Oh. There you go. All right, well, Pearson, two guys left. What is your ideal first date? Downtown to a nice restaurant by the beach, probably. Oh! oh. What kind of food, though? Uh, it depends, man. What are you into? Guess. Thai food? I'll allow it. <laughs> All right, number two. We can go to the beach, chill there, have a picnic. Ah, a food Whoa. on the beach. Who do you want to eliminate? Honestly, both of the answers were kind of similar, but I think the accent is going to take it home. So yes! I have to eliminate oh. number one. Number one, reveal yourself. Oh, come on. On three, okay? All right. One, two. Oh! 
Oh, no. All right, so Pearson, that leaves one guy. Number two. Number two. Yeah. Oh, when are we going on that picnic beach day? Whenever you want. You know oh. what? I don't think so. He's getting dunked. What? No. Bye. Oh, he, won. he won. He won. Jealous. Wow. Sorry about that. I mean, I get it, man. <laughs> All right, so now it is time for the most extreme version of blind dating. The, the kissing, kissing booth. booth. Oh, now no. it's your turn. Oh, oh no. Yeah, we have four very fine girls here, and you're going to be blindfolded, and you're going to be kissing them. Ooh. What? Yep. All right, Brent, the first round is going to be a kiss on the cheek, but you're going to be blindfolded, so you have to eliminate someone without even looking. All right, okay, uh, let's, let's do it. All right, the first lady. Oh, got right Ooh. to it. Okay. How um, was that, Brett? That was actually really nice. Really? really? Mystery okay. lady number two. Oh. Oh. oh damn. You like that one? Oh, that I think one you like that, like that one. one. Yeah, that one was passionate. I feel like 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 she just went for it, you know? Yeah. Oh. oh. Damn. That, damn. Was, that was good. Hey. Yeah? I want to take her. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, oh whoa. wow, that was nice. <laughs> okay. Well, now you have to make a decision, Brent. All four girls went, so now you have to eliminate one. Eliminate one. I think I have my choice. Really? What is it? I'm gonna have to eliminate number three. Oh! oh. All right, Brent, now it's time to show you what you lost. Here you go. <laughs> I, I changed my mind. No, no, you can't. I'm sorry. Can I give you a hug? No. Oh! <laughs> What's round number two? Kiss on the lips, Brent. Ooh. What? All right, it's now time for girl number one. Round two. Let's go. Let's do it. Ooh. Oh! That was a good sound. Wow. That was pretty nice. Oh my gosh. You sound like you know what you're doing, Brent. What's going on? That was incredible. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Hell, that was good. What I is felt going on? Like she came in slow and she went oh, out slow. Oh, you got butterfly. That one may, might have gave me goosebumps. Oh, oh, really? Wow. wow. Last but not least. Oh. oh wow. That? Oh. that was nice. Yeah. <laughs> well, describe it. Well, it tasted like strawberries. Oh. oh. Yeah. Well, Time to eliminate one. Yeah. This is gonna be Which hard. One? No way. <laughs> How do yes. I eliminate them? Which are all good. Choose wisely. She better. Okay. Don't make the wrong decision. Girl number one. Oh, oh no! All right, Brent, you might have made a big mistake. Check it out. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're so cute. <laughs> Wait, why did you eliminate her? No hard feelings. Okay, okay, yeah. It was perfect. I mean, it was perfect. Now it's time for the final round. It's gonna be a little bit of a longer of a kiss. Are you ready for that? Yes. I'm, I'm ready. Lady number one. Things are getting serious. We're starting off strong. Oh wow. Oh, wow. wow. That was sweet. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what is going on? I felt the passion. Yeah, she's good. She's yeah. good? She's good. Wow. She's really good. Now it's time for the final girl. Oh my god. Wow, wow. Okay, that was that was good. I think Brian, wow. hey, get your thoughts together. You need to eliminate somebody and there's gonna be one final girl left. I think I've made my decision. Already? Really? I'm gonna have to eliminate kisser number one. <gasps> oh! Let's wow. see what you miss out on. <laughs> Pearson! Yeah! yeah. yeah. Wait, she's playing? <laughs> yeah, bro. Don't talk to me. Yeah, dude, you, you messed, messed up. up big time, you man. Messed you messed up. All right, it's time to reveal the lucky lady. Oh. oh. Okay. So, I'm Brent. Anna. Nice to meet you. Nice oh, she has an accent. Wow. All right, so uh, what are you doing after this? Brent, what, we're, we all were going to go to dinner. What are you doing? I think I'm just going to hang out with her. Oh, yeah. wow. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so the other day, we met a subscriber. His name is Vishnu. So we learned that Vishnu was never able to go to prom in high school, and we also learned that Vishnu loves Pearson and would love to go on a date with her. Yeah, he's stealing your girl. I know, but I'll let it slide. This time. <laughs> okay. So today, we're going to pick him up and surprise him with both of those things. Hey, hey, hey. Yo. Oh. So guys, this is Vishnu. So Vishnu, we have a very special surprise for you right now. Ooh. Are you ready? I'm all set. All right, we're gonna get you looking real nice. Let's do it. All right, let's go. <laughs> After helping him get ready for his big night, it was time for his reveal. Oh. Are you ready? I am all set. Let's do this. Do you have any guesses of what we're doing? Not at all. No, <laughs> I have no clue. <laughs> all right, so you're all dressed up. You know how you said you were never able to go to prom in high school, right? I've never been to prom. That's right. We oh. set something up for you inside. No way. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> this is incredible. <laughs> Obviously, you know, prom isn't prom without a date, right? That's right. We thought about it, and um, we have your date here. She's ready to see you. Oh, Pearson! <laughs> Let's have the night of our lives! Let's do it! <laughs> we come alive in the night. <laughs> Brent, you're ruining their game. What? Bye. Get out of here. I've been 
seeing someone for the past week and um, I just want to introduce you guys to her. Tori? Hi everyone. So last week, Andrew spilled some tea. He said he'd hook up with your sister. Yes. <laughs> so today, we're gonna find out the truth. I don't feel like they're gonna wanna do this. Well, they're gonna have to. <laughs> All right, so John, let's not do the test for real. We're gonna fake it so it seems like they like each other. Let's do it. All right, let's go. <laughs> All right, so we're here with Lexi and Andrew. Hey. So this is John. He's a professional lie detector guy. Why? <laughs> we're gonna get the truth today. Yes. <laughs> There's like nothing to worry about. Yeah, exactly, right? Come on. <laughs> Were you ever jealous of Ben? No. That's a lie. <laughs> Have you ever had a romantic dream about Lexi? No. That's a lie. <laughs> Do you have feelings for Lexi right now? No. Off the charts lie. Oh! <laughs> I like it's laughing now, but it's gonna be her turn soon. I know. <laughs> Can you see yourself marrying Andrew? No. <laughs> Lie. <laughs> uh, Lexi, if you can go back in time and you had the choice of dating Ben or Andrew, who would it be? I don't have any regrets, so Ben. Lie. What? <laughs> no, I think you're lying. <laughs> Do you have feelings for Andrew right now? No. This is like off the chart. Oh, no. Lie. I think Andrew's <laughs> blushing. <laughs> Okay, I have something to tell you. It is rigged. Okay. I, I knew it. I freaking knew it. <laughs> Wait, but John, what is actually happening though? We do have feelings for each other. <laughs> oh, okay. Hey, so Andrew and Caleb got in a little argument with my sister yesterday. <laughs> guys, 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 oh what is going on they here? They think that guys have it harder than girls. And we do. <laughs> guys, you do not want like, to go okay, down this path. Like, you know, okay, how about this? I want to I wanna do something. I will give you guys $500 if you go get your acrylic nails done right now for 24 hours. Easy. Money, what? Easy money. Come on, guys. Let's go to the nail salon. I'm scared. <laughs> they look so beautiful. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right, Lexi, ready for the reveal? I'm ready. All right, so boys. <laughs> ah! <laughs> okay. This is so easy. What do you mean? So you have to go to the bathroom. <laughs> oh, I didn't even think about that. <laughs> you lied. Easy money. Come on. Ow! What are you? What the? I got it. Boom. Cut the pieces and then. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, this is good. <laughs> Wow. It's like I have a girlfriend right now. Yeah, but we all know you can't get that. <laughs> <laughs> so Caleb is in the bathroom right now. I think he's having a really hard time. I can't wait. I know I got you. I got you. I got myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I built a brown girl. I can't type. Look at this. I can't even log into my computer. Mm, look who's struggling okay. now. Oh. I'm cutting them off. Wait, what? Are, oh my god. Caleb. <laughs> No, no, no. Oh. All right, so, so you guys officially quit. <laughs> yes, we quit. <laughs> At least you guys went six hours with them on. That's pretty impressive. It is. So That's... what did you learn here today? I learned that we were wrong. <laughs> Lexi was right. <laughs> So Caleb thinks that No, I don't think I know I can drink this whole thing in under five seconds. No, you can't. I'll bet you $100 All right, right now. $100. I'm going to poke a hole in it. Are you saying you're going to drink from that hole? Yes. You ready? Yeah. Wait, did you mean to do that? <laughs> what the f is wrong with you? Why would you do that? That was worth giving you $100. <laughs> you may now kiss the bride. So everyone knows Dom hangs out with Sophie all the time. Way too much. So Sophie didn't go to Vegas with us, but Dom did. Mm -hmm. So we're going to make up some rumors to tell Sophie. <laughs> Dom and Sophie about to be breaking up today. Oh. Hey. Uh, how's it going? This is gonna be hard to say. So obviously we went to Las Vegas, mm -hmm. um, yeah. and Dom went, and um, yeah. you know, I, let's just say Dom had like a little bit too much fun. A little yeah. too much fun. Yeah. What does that mean? So we found Dom at a strip club. He was at a strip club. He was all over all of these girls. Then after we went, we went to, to the a club. To a club. <laughs> we went to the club. This girl right here, he was into. Yeah. Wow, that's definitely not photoshopped at all. He brought two girls back Literally. with him. Here's the photo. That's the photo. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. What's up? So you wanna explain yourself? We had to tell her, Dom. What? I thought what tell happened in, in, in Vegas. Yeah. What happened in Vegas? Dom, just tell me. Tell you what? <laughs> what happened in Vegas? What is that? Explain this picture, Dom. I don't know how Explain to this explain this picture with Dude, that's not me! What do you mean? That's obviously <laughs> No! Bro, that's what not about me. You at the this? strip club. What? What are these? I don't I, 
bro. I can't with you guys. <laughs> it was pretty good, right? <laughs> Stop, bro. bro, I can't. What is this? <laughs> Wait, so are we gonna tell them what happened with you and Pearson in Vegas, or? Um. All right, guys. That's all shit. You're definitely my most attractive teacher. <laughs> Do you think he would have a shot, maybe? So Dom couldn't get into a party last night because he wasn't on the list. No Dom. There's no way. <laughs> so we decided that we wanted to bring the party to him in his bedroom. Except he's not going to be able to get in. <laughs> yeah, so the funny thing is he's actually not going to be on the list. <laughs> Alright, so Dom, you know how last night you weren't allowed in the party? Dude, I knew you were going to bring this up. Why do you keep bringing this up? So, uh, while you're at the gym, we decided to bring the party to you. Oh no, what does that mean? Aren't you excited? I'm nervous, friend. <laughs> hey, what's up? So, what's up? my name? Um, Dom? Dom Brack? Yeah, you're not on the list. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> no, yeah, you're not We're here for Dom's party. Oh, for sure. Why would they here for my party? I am Dom. This is my room. Sounds good or not, but you're not on the list. Bro, <laughs> Brad! <laughs> I can go in, right? Yeah, for sure, bro. Oh, cool. I'll see you later, Dom. I was killed allowed in. Yo, 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 I think your car's being towed right now. Like, actually, like, it's actually. Oh! <laughs> You definitely set this up so I wasn't on the list, bro. Well, of course I did. <laughs> Alright guys, so this is Jake. He makes crazy inventions and we're gonna recreate some famous movie scenes. Let's go! Let's go. Uh, this is a real Harry Potter one. Oh my god! Whoa! I love that from here. Me and Caleb are gonna give this one a try. We meet again, Malfoy. Potter. Incendio! Oh, okay. wow. Wow. wow, it actually worked. <laughs> this is a fire sword. Yeah. Oh my god! I'm gonna get lit on fire. Oh my. So Jeremy's gonna try it out. Oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, so what do we have here? Spider Man wall climbers. Uh, Yo! No! Holy crap! Why? Why? <laughs> I cannot believe my eyes. Oh my god. I got you, bro. I got you. Holy god. Yeah. Alright, so this is a Thor hammer that shoots lightning. Oh my. Whoa. Yo, what the? I'm Thor. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, so for some reason, Caleb wants to get shocked. By I don't it. know why. Do Don't give me a countdown. Okay, three. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so today I am here with Liv. What up, guys? And she sounds exactly like Ariana Grande. <laughs> <laughs> and we're gonna be surprising all of my friends. Oh, hey. Okay, you're scary good. <laughs> Take a seat right there. I would say you guys really like her. Yeah. And I honestly really like you too. <laughs> So, go ahead and sing, no, go ahead and sing a song. Yeah, my receipts be looking like phone I don't mean a brag, but I would like put it in. <laughs> hey, you guys wait, can wait, take wait, your wait. blindfold off. It's right on. Wait. Oh, wait, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> you sound just like that. No, hey. Oh. I'm so into you, I can barely breathe. What's your, what's your? Oh my <laughs> I thought that you're not cool enough to get real Ariana Grande. <laughs> wow, she sounds just like her. <laughs> Can you stay up all night? Oh, me to the day. Stop. Wait, what? Stop. No. Wait. Stop. Take your blindfolds off. When am I? <laughs> oh my god. You see me? I was like, yo, what? <laughs> you know, I'm sure you're lovely, but we're a little bit disappointed. <laughs> no, but. Oh my god. Alright, so Caleb is about to play the mystery box game. Woo! One of these boxes has $500 in it, and the other two have consequences. Mm. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> so you have two tries to get the box with the prize. Alright, let's do what it. What is your first pick? This box. Slime! No! <laughs> Why? <I'm so> <laughs> oh my god! Holy s! <laughs> Alright, Caleb, you have one more chance to pick. I'm going with that one. This one? Yeah. Congratulations! Yeah! You won the $500! Alright, so right now, we're gonna be pranking our friends into thinking that Caleb is kissing <laughs> his high school teacher. So this is Miss Kamara, and she's an actress that's playing Caleb's chemistry teacher. And we're gonna see how our friends react when Caleb suddenly makes out with her. Dude, everyone's gonna freak out. <laughs> Alright, so we have a little surprise for you, Caleb. Okay. I don't know if you remember her, but her. I remember you telling me that she was one of your favorite teachers. <laughs> it's uh, Miss Kamara. Oh shit! <laughs> oh, what the f Was he a good student? He's the best student. Okay. <laughs> Have you ever had to call Caleb's parents? Multiple times, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> so obviously, Caleb, you're 21. Time has flying by. Hasn't <laughs> really has. uh, Caleb has mentioned to me he thought you were really pretty. Oh. You were definitely my most attractive teacher. <laughs> Do you think he would have a shot? Maybe. Me? Yeah, it's a prank on you. <laughs> I'm so she's lost. Not actually, she's not actually a teacher, she's an actress. Does he have a chance? Oh, wow. Well, maybe. Oh, sh. Damn. Okay. Oh, crap. Yeah, this is on. oh sh. Wait, what? Wait. <laughs> what the f? Bro, no way. You certainly have grown up. Thank you. <laughs> what? Bro, what? There's no way she's your teacher, dog. No, she's not. <laughs> I knew it, bro. She's just an actress. <laughs> oh my god. I was like, what the f <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh, that. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh. Wait, <laughs> this is your teacher? What's happening, bro? Damn. Yo. I mean, She's not actually Caleb's teacher. Oh my god. <laughs> bro, I was like, I look back and I'm like, is this actually happening right now? No, she's just an actress. Bro. All right, so we saw this crazy talented kid on TikTok and we decided to see it for ourselves. He performs in Venice Beach. All right, so what's your name? Gabriel. How old are you, Gabriel? Eight. Let's see what you got. Gabriel, that was a really awesome performance. How old are you again? You're eight. Eight years old, and you're that good? You dance, you sing, you do everything. Okay, so why do you love street performing so much? I get to meet a lot of people, and it's very, very fun. So what's your day-to-day -day like? I get here from the bus. I sleep on the bus. As soon as we get to Venice, we work. Are you proud of your son? He amazed me, and he got a good heart, too. Uh, yeah. Um, I am very inspired, and I want you to do well. So I have a little surprise for you. I want to give you $3,000. Oh, to help you oh, pursue your dream. No. This, this is gonna help me a lot. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna help me super. So I'm gonna give 1,000 to my sister, 1,000 to my dad, and then, um, I don't know. I'm speechless. You deserve it, so keep up the good work, okay? Keep killing it. <laughs> All right, so Hiram finally got his hero arm. Let's check it out. Yo! <laughs> so sick. It's literally Iron Man. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> This week, we take kissing lessons, and let's just say things get a little spicy. Wait till the end of the video to oh see what happens. My <sighs> Are we matching? Why are you all dressed up? I have a date tonight. Hey, okay, okay, I see you, I see you. Where'd, Where'd you, you meet her? The mall. What? what? We, we both met her at the mall? What, what does she look like? Are, are we, we going, going out with the same girl? I saw her first. No, I did. She's here! Bro, let me go on a date with her! You always do this! Hi, how are you guys? Oh, they're twins! Score! Alright, so right now we're here at the gymnastics gym and we're gonna be playing the hole in the wall challenge. So we're gonna be jumping through shapes like this? Yeah. It's gonna get a little dangerous. <laughs> wait, wait, what? <laughs> Ashton, you got this, right? Yeah, I think I can do that. <laughs> uh, Oh, oh my god. god! You broke the shape! That was such a fail. This is supposed to be the easiest one! Oh! Oh! oh. 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 That was so close! That was smooth! God, Ashton sucks! I say we make this a little bit harder. What do you guys think of level two here? Easy. Cannonball straight through. Oh! Hey, that was cool. I did not think I was gonna make that. Oh! oh. I'm sorry, dude. I thought I was gonna make it. Well, you did. This is gonna be like impossible. I don't know how we're gonna do this. <laughs> oh. oh! That counts, right? I guess. Yeah. Let's go! Oh, what? Oh. No! Oh. Did I do it? Yeah, you did. This is the final shape. This isn't a shape. What is this? How am I supposed to fit through this? You guys are gonna have to go in together on oh. this one. Oh, we go like that? Uh huh. No! Oh! <laughs> They failed miserably, but we're gonna come out strong. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Bro! Okay, that one, that 
That one's so wrong. Dude, Dude, I think they did worse than us. <laughs> After the gym, I had to rush home because I had a big surprise for my friends. Three, two, one. <gasps> what? Oh my god. Oh my god, you put a giraffe what? in your front yard. <laughs> Can we keep them? We're gonna put them. Inside. In about like five months, it's not gonna fit in there. It's next to be like this. What in the heck is going on? Is it gonna stay for long? Yeah. Oh, hi. Oh, he likes the camera. Oh so when Jerry's full grown, he's gonna be over 20 feet tall. He's gonna be double the size. Not only did the neighbor stop by to check out our new pet, but Pearson's mom was not expecting this. <laughs> oh my god. A trap in your yard. <laughs> I knew she'd love it. I love it. Good. <laughs> oh, be careful. There's poop right there. <laughs> oh my god, it's like all over my shoe. <laughs> Just another casual day at Brent's house. <laughs> yeah, exactly. This is a normal water gun. And this is the world's most powerful water gun. Oh my god. We're about to prank my friends. Let's go. Hey Drew. Why oh, you look so How's it going? <laughs> This thing is gnarly. Isn't it crazy? Alright, now it's my turn. No, 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 no. Ah! Ashton is tanning right now in my backyard. We're gonna give him a nice little squirt. Hey, buddy. Ah, bro. Oh, 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 oh. Bro, what? That hurts so bad. Dom's taking birthday photos right now. I'm gonna sneak up on him. Fire! Fire! Oh my god, yo! Fred! Fred! What did you do? Oh, what? Why are you taking birthday photos? What are you doing? You an open flame! That's a candle, bro! Oh! <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> as much fun as this was, I told my YouTuber friend James Charles I would watch his house and his dogs while he's gone for the day. And the best part about it, he's rich and his house is huge. We are here. Time to knock. Hey, hey how's it going, James? How are you? Well, That's a really big bag. I'm only going to dinner for like an hour or two. Yeah, no, I just wanted to make myself at home. You know how it is. Like, yeah, don't worry about it. I mean, oh. you know, we're, we're, we're friends. We'll see you later, James. Okay. Have fun. Okay. This trampoline is massive and is built into the ground. This is in his backyard. Okay, so James has an Olympic sized pool. I don't know why you would need a pool this big. This is like my dream house. I always wanted to do this. Hey, sisters, James Charles here, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Yes! I did it! Um, we have this new brand, it's called Painted. This one's Pinky Promise. In this room, he has all of his merch. Look at all this merch here. I'm gonna take this one, I'm gonna take this one, I'm gonna take this one. Definitely this. You think you'll notice? Yo, I'm just trying to get as much merch as I can. I can definitely sell all this on eBay. So James did mention that I do have to feed the dogs and pick up their poop. It would have been nice for him to actually let me know where the dog food was. Oh, this is the fridge. Oh, here we are. We found the dog food. And after feeding his dogs, it was time to take care of some business. We gotta locate the poop and then pick it up. There's poop over here. All right, here we go. Just picking up the poop. Ooh. This is the basement. Look at this. What in the world? He has the Travis Scott shoes. These things are like $2,000. The Dior Jordans. Bro, that's insane. So you're telling me these are $14,000, these shoes? Yeah. Yo, hopefully he doesn't see that I wore these. Yo, these outfits are crazy. I think uh, part of the pant is missing, but uh, we're just gonna strap it in anyway. Damn, I look freaking good! This is fashion. This is fashion. This is his movie theater. <gasps> I'll see you next week. Bye! Nice video, James! Nice video! You hear that? Someone's here. I thought, I thought no one was home. Hey, uh, who are you? I'm the end housemate. So what, what do you do around here? Clean. Nice. Mm -hmm. um, do you ever like, you know, when James is gone, do you ever just like just mess around and do fun stuff? No. Would you want to? Maybe. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> so uh, this is actually mm -hmm. my YouTube channel. Um, I make better videos than uh, James Charles, so. Oh. Yeah. I do. While I was quite literally making myself at home, I had an unexpected <sighs> visitor. This is the life. Did someone just ring the doorbell? Coming, coming, coming. Yo! Dom? What's up, dude? This is a crazy place. What are you doing here? I just, I heard you had a sick pad. I thought I'd come check sick it out. Sick pad? This is not my pad. What? Whose house is this? James Charles. Why are you in James Charles' house? Oh, um, is this about time to tell you I have a girl coming over? What? Yeah, she's like right here. Bro, no. You can come in. Hi, how are you? Great, how are you? Can I have a word with you yeah. for a sec? Yeah, okay, yeah, one sec. Okay, well, if it makes you feel any better, she thinks this is your house. Who's your designer? Guys, I, I think it's time to go, actually. What? Yeah. Come on, we just got here, Brad. Oh, I think it's time to go. I don't think it's time to go. Come okay, on. no, no, unfortunately. No, come on, please, leave, please. 
Who? Oh my God, it's James Charles. Brent, who are these people? The, 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 uh, Why do you have my bathrobe on? That's weird. Who are you? This is your house? Yeah, this is my house. I gotta go. This is so weird. Brent, are you kidding me? Hey, wait, hold on. Wait. Why is Dom here? All right, well, uh, have a good night, James. Thank you for uh, uh, choosing Brent's house hitting business, and uh, we'll see you later. Peace, bye. So, wait, let me get this straight, Dom. So, you went to the fair with her, mm -hmm. you kissed her at the fair, mm -hmm. and then when you dropped her off, she told you you were a bad kisser. No, she texted me the next day telling me I was a bad kisser. Bro! And I, I'm literally, I'm not. I don't know what she's talking about. You're not a bad kisser? People have told me before that I'm a good kisser. So, the very next day, I decided to get a professional kisser to educate him. I, dude, I don't know why she said that, bro. Like, I, it cannot be true. I got a professional kisser here so that she can show you and us what makes a 10 out of 10 kiss. What? Wow. Yeah. <laughs> My name's Sabrina. I'm the professional the kisser. Heck? Dom, I heard you need a little bit of help with kissing. You told her? But we're gonna fix that to make sure that never happens again. So how do the sessions work? I mean, do you just make out with people? It depends on what type of bundle you, you get. Uh, what bundle did we get? <laughs> <laughs> we'll find out a little later. <laughs> I personally think that we should set the mood. Okay. So, I heat up the hot tub. And you, okay. guys, you guys brought your bathing suits, right? Yeah. Yes. All right, cool. Let's let's jump in and we can get started. Before you lean in, you have to make sure your breath is fresh, right? Oh, so yeah, I suggest course. that everyone carries around a breath spray. Do you have a brand if recommendation? You know, <laughs> it's the Listerine, and then you just go like this. <laughs> Dog, you may need two, honestly. Uh -huh. <laughs> Jeremy needs three sprays. Okay. One, We're gonna two, do. Three. Oh. No one wants to kiss someone with bad breath. Exactly. I'm gonna demonstrate with someone. So if anyone wants a volunteer. To do the exercise? Uh, I mean. Okay. okay. <laughs> You're gonna wanna make eye contact, right? Okay. You're gonna wanna lean in a little bit okay. and see if she also leans in, right? If she like starts backing away, read the body language. Okay, right? okay, okay. Yeah. Oh my god, your hands are tiny. <laughs> your hands are big. Really? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Well, wow, now that you guys are holding hands. See, that was that you that was way too quick. I thought that was good! No, no, no. <laughs> you have really pretty eyes. Thank you. Yeah. You do too. Really? Yeah. Thank you. I appreciate it. Um, hold on. This is really hard, okay? <laughs> Your eyes are just beautiful. Wow, yours are too. Thank you. Oh my god! Let's go! Let's go! That was good. That was good. Yeah! <laughs> what do you know about French kissing? So, that's in a different bundle. It would cost another extra thousand dollars. Oh my god! You like put together maybe a thousand dollars? Yeah, yeah, I, could I literally gym, think right? I have a thousand dollars. Do I like shake your hand? Like. Thank you oh, well, we for are that. Kissed, yeah, right? yeah, so, yeah. yeah I mean, thank okay. you. No feelings, right? Yeah. I mean, it's just her job, right? It's like, it's, it's, yeah. It's Dom, personal. no feelings? It's just her job, right? <laughs> <laughs> I think we all became better kissers. What do you say? I think we're all a bunch of losers. <laughs> So today we're gonna play a game. You guys ready? I'm ready. Wait, what's the game? So if you're the one that grabs the egg, you get to crack on the other person's head. Oh, let's go. <laughs> Toes, eyes, nose, egg. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Three, two, one. Oh! oh I'm glad I'm not dumb. All right, you guys ready for the next item? Oh! Toes, knees, iPad. All right, so now we have a nice yummy sandwich. You get to slap the other person with it. Oh, wait, what? Knees. Oh! Hey, this is what you get for taking my iPad. Bro. Oh! 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 Yeah, that's what you get. Are you serious? $200 cash. Oh! Toes, nose, lips, money. Knees, eyes, head, gun. Oh! So guys, I have a really special surprise for you. Uh -huh. Welcome to the Brent Spa. Yo, yeah. what? <laughs> That's for me and Jeremy? All right, so Jeremy, are you ready to meet your beauty therapist? I mean, I guess. Wow. Wow. Hi, I'm Heather. All right, let's do it. <laughs> Jeremy's excited. And Ben, let me introduce you to your beauty therapist. Okay. Uh, Nana. Oh, okay. <laughs> So, uh, how old do you happen to be? I'm 21. 21? Oh. How old are you? Okay. And I'm 80, but I'll take good care of you. 
<laughs> oh yeah. It feels good. How does it feel, Ben? Dude, it feels nice. <laughs> so Heather, uh, how's your love life going? I'm single. Oh really? Ooh. Yeah. yeah, this feels really good. That's not the only thing that's gonna feel good. Oh. <laughs> All right, we're all finished. Oh boo. Yeah. How was your experience, Jeremy? Oh, 10 out of 10, man. Me and her are gonna go actually on a date now. <laughs> <laughs> we're going too. No. Yeah. All right, so we have a tube with a live cockroach in the middle. Both of you guys are gonna blow as hard as you can and one person is gonna end up with a live cockroach in their mouth. I'm terrified. <laughs> this is probably the scariest thing I've ever done. I'm about to throw up my dinner. <laughs> All right, three, two, one, go. Oh my God. <laughs> It tastes like poop. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Pearson are next. No, 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 we're not. I'm good. This is Lance. Hi. Lance does a lot of the behind the scenes stuff, I including do. filming. He runs basically the whole Amp World channel. I feel like this last year, you've helped me a lot. You know, you've been my right hand man for literally this whole last year. You know, a lot of the pictures and stuff that you guys see as well, you know, like Lance takes them. So, you know, you do a lot for me. And so I wanted to give you a little gift for the holidays. Um, I want to give you $10,000. Right. For helping out this last year. <laughs> oh, Lance! Oh. <laughs> what the f? <laughs> You're the best. All the experiences that I've made with you guys are so priceless. I literally love you guys. I have no words. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so my flight got delayed, so I missed the New Year's countdown, but I have such good friends that they're gonna help me recreate it, right? <laughs> The actual countdown. It was really fun. You missed so much. Yeah, oh my god. I miss? You, you kissing miss another guy? Whoa. <laughs> What's your New Year's resolution? Not be single for the whole year. Hear that, <laughs> what about you, Andrew? What's your New Year's resolution? Probably give you a nice little kiss. Oh, oh wait. So, Dom, who's your New Year's kiss? My New Year's kiss was. Wasn't me. <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> Is Pearson gonna be your New Year's kiss today? I don't know. I mean, it's up to her. No. Really? What? <laughs> so guys, there's literally three minutes until the new year. Ooh. Honestly, I think the highlight of my year was when I took Pearson to Paris. Oh. Yeah, what happened in Paris exactly? We all saw the video. You guys talks, never talked about it. <laughs> yeah. well, uh, the, um, you also slept in the same bed together, so. Um, well, we, we probably wasn't a lot of sleeping going on. <laughs> <laughs> it's 2.59! Oh. 15, 14, 14 13, 13, 4, 3, 2, 1! This $100,000 night hotel room is one of the biggest, most luxurious hotel rooms in the entire world. And in this video, we are going to be staying here as well as a $30,000 hotel room with a bowling alley inside, a $1,000 floating hotel room, and a $100 hotel room that's a real mini castle. But first, let's start with this $1 hotel in Los Angeles. Where's the hotel room? Well, it's not a room, it's a capsule. Dude, this is weird. Yo! Oh my god! <laughs> Holy crap! This is what you meant by capsule. It looks like we're literally in a spaceship right now. Okay, there's even more over here. And keep in mind, anyone can rent these capsules out at any time. How do we know people are sleeping in here? Oh, they could be. <laughs> so you can rent one of these pods for $1 an hour, and it comes with a ton of things. Check this out. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. It's so small. <laughs> you get a TV for a dollar. Yo, this Yo, is actually spacious. Crap. This is like a full-blown room. Check this out. So this button changes the lighting on the top. Like a cover. And then this one changes the lighting of this little mirror thing. Watch this. Green, red, so and you get then... to like fully customize your pod. Exactly. Yeah. And this button is a reading light. Let's be honest, I'm not reading. No one <laughs> ever, no one. So uh, we're gonna be sleeping together tonight, boys. As All long right. as nobody farts in this thing, we're okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. We're gonna get some rest because tomorrow we're going to the 100 $100 hotel. It better be a three bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, good night, guys. So, we were off to the Midwest where we'd be paying $100 a night for a mini castle. This is insane. That looks so sick. I'm ready to go inside. Let's go slay some dragons. I'm not gonna lie, it doesn't look like there's enough bedrooms for all of us. <laughs> oh! Wait, what? Oh my god. 
god. <laughs> this is nice. Oh my god. Okay, this is an actual castle. This is actually sick right here, the glass. We have electric stoves, we have the cutting board, the full kitchen. Wait, but it's kind of small. Where, where's the bed? Uh, how do we know it comes with one? Brett? What? There's a hand on the ground. That can only mean one thing, right? Do you think that opens? What if it's the bedroom? In every scary movie, they tell you not to open the trap door. But they still do it anyway, so that's what we're gonna do. All right. All right. Oh my. I'm not going. Ashley there. goes first. I'm not, I'm not going. <laughs> Why is it dark? I swear we opened it and flies came up. <laughs> Guys, this is a hotel. It should be fine. It's probably the bedroom. Sweet. All right, then you go first. <laughs> this is crazy. Oh my god. Guys, there's a bedroom down here. What is that? the shower. This is the bathroom, actually. This is literally underground, this, oh, this bathroom. It's literally like a rock. The real question is, though, is all the spider webs decoration, or is it real? <laughs> it's like, this looks like it's from the 1800s. Check this out. What? Oh, oh my god. god! Where did you find that? I found it in there. I would say this mini castle is pretty nice for a hundred bucks. Like, it has everything. Drew, where are you sleeping? I'm going to the couch. Okay, and then what about you, Ashton? Uh, nice don't sleep. I'm huh? staying right here. Alright, okay, whatever. Alright, uh, you guys have fun down there. Alright, good night, Drew. And when I woke up the next morning, I picked up some new friends and we flew all the way to Mexico. Okay, so this next hotel room goes for $1,000 a night. It is a floating house in Mexico. I'm what? so excited to see this. And right when we walked in, they greeted us with a mariachi band. No! What hotel room comes with a mariachi band? Seriously. For $1,000, this hotel room was exceeding our expectations. Not to mention, the room came ready with fruit, wine, and chocolate-covered strawberries. Dude, this is so romantic. You really brought me instead of Pearson, bro? What are you doing? She said she was busy. No, I think she just didn't want to go with you. <laughs> this hotel was incredibly spacious. This bathroom is insane. Look at these sinks. Oh my god. And there were two showers. One inside that doubles as a sauna, and one outside right next to your private hot tub. No way! Right, how are you gonna find a hotel room better than this? Just wait, we have There's no way. There's, there's no better. Way. And it's hard to believe considering this view. No way there's a pool. This is an infinity pool overlooking the entire lagoon. Dude, this is so cool. <laughs> Dom, I don't think you need the life vest. When you guys wake up in the water, you're gonna feel really stupid. Dude, the house isn't gonna sink. But if it does, I'm ready. <laughs> this is so relaxing. No! Oh my God. We then walked over to enjoy some of the Caribbean beach before watching the sunset on the rooftop of our hotel room. Cheers, guys. Cheers. <laughs> and at the end of the night, the staff had one last surprise for us. Oh, how did they make this? They gifted us a high heel and purse made completely out of chocolate. God. It's chocolate! <laughs> How does it taste? Real good. <laughs> hey, Brent, look. If you like a video on YouTube, see, like, uh -huh. then the YouTube icon turns rainbow. Wait, how did you do that? I don't know. I just like the video. Guys, like the video and see if that works for you. Next, we were off to Vegas to stay at not one, but two $30,000 hotel rooms. We were at the Palms Casino in Las Vegas, and for this next hotel, we actually have two separate rooms costing more than $30,000 a night. What makes it $30,000? You're just going to have to let the room speak for itself. Bro. Oh. oh. Oh, oh my god, it's beautiful! Whoa. Oh my god! Oh. <laughs> we have a bowling alley. <laughs> this is insane! <laughs> We're staying here? Yep. This is unreal. This is unreal. Welcome to the Kingpin Suite. My name is James. I'm going to be your butler while you're staying here. Our butler James then handed us some complimentary champagne and showed us a chocolate bowling ball which we had to break open. Oh! oh. Chocolate bowling ball is so extra. <laughs> Have you guys ever seen a hotel room with a bowling alley inside before? I didn't know this existed. <laughs> Liv is lost for words. <laughs> <laughs> this room has five TVs to watch while bowling, a private bar, and pool table. Um, this isn't your room, actually, so I don't know why you're so... Dude, you know what? I'm moving in. <laughs> so the first room is actually a bunk oh, room. What? Oh my Wait, god, what? what the hell? I was not expecting this! This is like the ultimate bunk bed. Dude, this why, is so like, cool. why? This is honestly so pointless, but it's so sick! This is the bathroom over oh, here. This is beautiful! Oh my god! Right when we walked into the master bedroom, we were in awe, and the bathroom was even bigger than the last one. Dude, this could fit, like, probably... 25 people. And since we had our butler James for the next 24 hours, we decided to put him to the test. We have the power to just ask you like anything? Correct. What would you like? What would you like, Pearson? Um, okay, anything. Uh, any okay. chocolate fountain. Chocolate fountain? <laughs> You've got it. Wait, what? There's no way. You can just get a chocolate fountain? He's gonna pull it out of his pocket? Like, where is it coming from? <laughs> Go! Whoa. One chocolate oh. fountain? That was in like two minutes. Who's a better bowler, Pearson or Liv? Obviously, it's me. me. Oh, uh, me. Oh, oh, okay. Me. All right, let's settle, let's settle this once okay, and for all. Right. Three, two, one. Oh, no. 
while Liv was hitting strikes and Pearson was hitting absolutely nothing, James had finished up preparing our chocolate fountain. James, you are the best. That's impressive, but James, is there any way you can bring me a hot dog, a jar of mayonnaise, a Kit Kat, four glazed donuts, and two jugs of milk? Why? He can do anything, right? I can do it. I'll see you soon then. Don't do it. <laughs> Fruits and veggies when they're covered in chocolate. Oh my god! Right, guys. Cheers. Cheers. This was definitely the best chocolate we've ever tasted, and not even five minutes later, James had returned. When he said anything, he meant anything. All right, wait, wait. So we got the mayonnaise, the Kit Kat, the donuts, the two jugs of milk, and the hot dog. <laughs> What do you need all this stuff for? Just eat. Oh my god. <laughs> After another round of bowling, it was time to go next door to check out the second $30,000 a night suite. Oh my god, it's huge! This room has two master suites, a private gym, a sauna, and much, much more. Welcome to a Pearson Eyes room. This does not only fit two people, this fits the whole city of Las Vegas. Literally. Guys, this is one of the craziest hotel rooms I've ever seen before. So you have like your living area on this side. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> Oh my gosh, wait, what? This room has an infinity pool 30 stories up, which overlooks all of Las Vegas. You didn't say to bring a bathing suit, bro. Look at I this. Don't care. Oh my god. While touring the room, we found two couches that could easily sit 100 people, a bar that runs the full length of the hotel room, and even its own massage what? room. What? Oh my god. This room comes with unlimited massages, so you can get one whenever you want. There's two bedrooms, so this is one of them. Beautiful. That closet is huge. And this bathroom has a TV built in, so you can watch anything you want while taking a bath. Over here on this side, we have a gym and a sauna. Oh, what? What the? Look how big this sauna is, too. All of us can fit in here. And then you have your own private gym over here. Oh, this is so nice. And to think that you're not even gonna use the gym. I know. <laughs> you're right, I'm not. Uh, Drew, from what I remember, you have the other suite, so why are you laying in my bed? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna bowl, and then we're gonna come down here and go in the pool and get best of both worlds. We're gonna share the room. Yes! <laughs> Let's do it! Drew and I decided to cool off in our in-suite high-rise pool, but after drying off and getting ready, Pearson was nowhere to be found. Pearson? Hello? Oh, oh Pearson! Huh? Here's the thing. I was relaxed about when did you guys walk in? Thirty seconds ago. About about thirty seconds ago. <laughs> I was relaxed really? until about then. And finally, I was off to Houston to stay at the one hundred thousand dollar hotel room. Okay, so we don't even need to drive to this hotel. They're picking us up in a helicopter and flying us to the rooftop because we have the penthouse suite. What? How? <laughs> Straight from the helicopter to our room. Uh huh. That is luxury. All right, this is our helicopter. Oh my god, dude, dude. this is so sick. <laughs> Dude, if this is our ride, I can't even imagine the room. Bro. Yo, I think I found a snack pile. <laughs> oh my god. Hey Dom, aren't you scared of flying? Yes, I am. Are we sure we can't get like a ride from someone? We're gonna be landing on top of a building. Does that scare you? Yes! <laughs> of course that scares me. Regardless, we were off. And while Drew and I had the time of our lives, Dom was fighting for his life. And we finally came in view of our penthouse suite. A two-story, 22,000 square foot penthouse with its own private helipad. But we're landing on the roof right now. We were immediately greeted personally by the hotel manager alongside some complimentary champagne from one of our three butlers. Join us with a little bit of champagne. Oh, perfect. Thank you so much. Welcome to the property. Good guy. <laughs> this room is insane. Is this right. the room or the lobby? We just took the elevator straight here. So there's a private elevator. Are you guys ready to see the room? Yes, <laughs> yes bro. Oh my god. Oh my God. This is not a hotel room. This is the Oak Post Penthouse Suite, a six bedroom, seven bath hotel with a private gym, infinity pool, state of the art gaming room, and so much more. Oh There's no God. way. This is the nicest hotel room I've ever <laughs> seen in my life. Oh my God. Dude, you could fit like a hundred people in here and still have room. We literally are just three people and we have this entire penthouse to ourselves. The last hotel I stayed at, the lobby wasn't even this nice. No, <laughs> this is the massage room. Why do you need a massage room? What for massages, dude. <laughs> I call first. So this is one bedroom, and here's another room. Yo, this is like the biggest shower I've ever seen before. I've always wanted to take a bath in front of an entire city. <laughs> I feel like we've been touring this room for like 30 minutes already, and we're not even halfway through it. No. My legs are getting tired. We haven't <laughs> even checked out the other floor. <laughs> so we headed down the golden staircase to explore the second half of this penthouse. Dude, it just keeps going. What? This is crazy! This is the nightclub portion of the suite. Shut what? up! Yeah, you have your own nightclub Are in this serious? hotel. Oh that my god. That is so cool. But wait, Drew, there's more. I know there is. Come over here. There's a mini golf course. Oh, what? What yeah. the fuck? It's a full on putting green inside your hotel room. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh, oh, oh. 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 
So there's a bunch of arcade games in this room as well. So this is like the ultimate entertainment room. Dude, I'm spending all my time here. And this might be the best part about this room. Is there it? is a basketball court inside the hotel room. <laughs> what? Oh my god. This is in our hotel. Oh my god. Yo! Our downstairs neighbors are gonna hate us. <laughs> Think about the type of people that probably stay here. Like I know. celebrities, like the president. Like who would actually stay here? <laughs> James. Ron James has probably touched this basketball right here. <laughs> <laughs> this place literally couldn't get better. And then it continues to get better. We then toured the private movie theater inside the hotel room, which comes with its own candy and popcorn machine. Plus the recliner movie theater seats for 12 people. No this way. is like better than the normal movies. Oh my god! They have a PS5. No way, no way. No. I'm sleeping here. Drew, there's seven bedrooms. Screw the other bedrooms, I'm here. <laughs> we could have literally all of our friends in this movie theater. If only we had friends. <laughs> and this private gym was the size of an actual gym. Dude, it's like a whole gym. You literally get to work out while looking over the whole city. All right, you hit the nightclub, I'll hit the basketball court, and then we'll switch in 30, right? All right, all right. break. <laughs> wait, wait, guys. Okay, this room is so big, I lost Drew and Dom. Drew! Dom! Yeah, can I get two pizzas, a milkshake, chicken strips, some fries, and maybe... <laughs> What? It's on the room. Oh. oh, get the fruit platter. And then, and then can I get a fruit platter? <laughs> Since Drew ordered the entire menu, it made perfect sense to kill time in the pool. I think Drew's about to do something stupid. Oh my god! Oh my god! Is the camera good? Yeah, the camera's okay, good. Back. Oh my this is by far one of the nicest hotel rooms I've ever stayed at in my entire life. And when we got out of the pool, the hotel gifted us custom robes, each with our own names on it. It's such a little touch, but like, Robes with your name on it is like one of the best things ever. Dude, I'm taking this home. Yeah, me for too. Sure. This is a bigger fruit platter than I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> the pizza looks amazing. Mm. Is it good? Mm -hmm. I know that we could be ordering food all day, but uh -huh. we have so much more stuff to do here. So we hopped in the gym to burn the meal off before spending hours in the game room. We played arcade games, <laughs> foosball, mini golf, and of course some basketball. And once the sun went down, it was time for us to party it up in the private nightclub, where we danced for hours and even got a little crazy. Afterwards, we loaded up on the snacks inside the movie theater and got comfortable to watch Drew play some video games. So now Drew's playing Fortnite. He's actually about to play. Oh my god. Oh! 